While the war between Ukraine and Russia continues fiercely, we continue to bring you new developments. Here are the new developments. Intense fighting continued close to the city of Avdivka in the Donetsk region of eastern Ukraine. Russia said Ukrainian drones damaged a nuclear waste storage facility at the Kursk nuclear power plant on Thursday evening. This comes after the press service for the plant told journalists on Friday that there had been no significant damage from the attacks and that operations were continuing as normal. Russia loses 6,500 soldiers near Avdivka in October 2023, Ukrainian military says. From 10th of October, the losses of the Russian army in the area of responsibility of the Operational Strategic Group of Forces Tavria in Donetsk Oblast amount to almost 6,500 soldiers said the spokesperson for the defense forces of the Tavria Front, Alexander Stupin. Ukraine's electrical infrastructure came under massive shelling by Russian forces in the winter of 2022, leaving millions of people in the dark and cold. Although repairs have since been carried out, Ukraine says it expects another series of strikes this winter and has asked its Western allies for new air defense systems. ISW Remnants of Wagner Group fighting near Avdivka on the Russian MOD The remnants of what was Russia's Wagner Group private military company appear to be fighting at Avdivka, ISW says. 